Hey, how's it going everybody? Schoolboys here again for another, well, no, no, I can't even say that. Today we're trying out a new game on the channel, actually. Um, in some regions it has different names. For me, we are trying out the new My Hero Academia, the strongest hero. I know for some of you guys it's called Ultra Impact as well. Um, it, as far as my knowledge, this is an RPG gotcha type of game. I'm genuinely not sure. I haven't seen any footage of this game yet. I'm going in with a blind reaction here. Um, I'm a big, I'm a big fan of my hero, I'd say. So, um, I'm really excited to see what this game holds. I'm really excited to see what a potential this game holds for the future and how it's gonna play overall. Like I said, as far as I know, it's a mobile RPG, kind of like Grand Cross. But otherwise, I haven't seen any footage. This is going to be a full blind reaction. So, with that said, let's go ahead and jump in and see how this game works. Now, I'm just saying this right now. This may or may not be muted. Um, uh, when I record, I have the audio down, so I have no idea what it's saying, but if there is copyrighted music in here, uh, I don't know. You guys can listen to, uh, I don't know. What do you guys want to listen to? Editor, you choose something. Wait, I'm the editor. I choose, I get to choose something. You know, one thing I will say for sure, um, oh, wait, am I doing this? Oh, okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> I was about to start talking, and then I noticed that I think I'm doing this right now. Yeah, one thing I did want to say was, uh, this game looks really clean. Like, keep, I will, I will keep in mind that this is just a cutscene at the end of the day. But so far, it already looks fairly clean just from, just from this. Even though this is really just me doing quick time events so far, I really do want to jump in and see how the actual gameplay is. Hi there, everyone. I'm Mount Lady. Okay, okay. Is this the actual game now? I think so. The models look pretty nice full 3d uh so far keep in mind i'm literally standing in place i will say that i i feel like grand cross just looks a little bit cleaner but i like how this um does represent the art style uh my hero fairly well so far hey boy turn around buddy what you doing man oh what the yeah you better run you better run bro there's the man, there's the main man, Mr. All Might here. What a Chad, bro. Oh, okay, that's pretty sick, actually. So we're gonna place All Might here. That young man is in danger. All right, let's go. Oh, okay, so it's like a beat-em-up style is from what it looks like. I just, I just keep pressing that. The animations look fairly nice. Oh my goodness, can I play now? No, still a cutscene. Let me just tell you guys, I am I am currently nine minutes into my recording, um, and it has just been cutscenes after cutscene after cutscene after cutscene. That I could just skip it right now, but they said I get a reward for sitting through the whole thing. But uh, come on, I just want to play. Okay, okay, Deku going in full throttle right here. Wait for it. There we go. Perfect. You already know how I do it. Okay, I guess he's taking notes. He's remembering those notes. Go another perfect. T double perfect. Throwing the bag at him. There we go. Okay, this is actually pretty sick. I like that right there. Okay. Okay, that actually looks pretty clean. I'm not even going to lie. Finally, can I please play? Now? I'm 12 minutes into the recording. Welcome to, you know, I'm not even going to do his voice. Just uh, forget this dude. Agency manager signature. Okay. You already know where we're going to put. I think that's, <laughs> I think that's what I'm supposed to put in there. Nicknames can be changed later. I'm pretty sure. Character is not used properly. What does that even mean? Illicit characters. What does that even mean? You know, this is always an issue with these gotcha games where it's like I can't put the name school because apparently like that is not allowed. Apparently, because my name is Schoolboys, I, I guess you can't do that. Well, I'll just have to go with that, I guess. <laughs> finally, I think in level two, I think that means we're finally playing. What the? What am I looking at? Why are there so many me's here? Oh my God, we're having a Deku party over here. What is going on? Alright, here we are. I think this is my first, like, actual stage here. Um, so I'm gonna stop these villains. Alright, I'm just hang up the phone here. Pathfinding. Okay, so this is where I start to get confused. Now I think I'm actually playing the game. So, 
There are challenges, no more than 20 hits and HP above 30% on clear. So let's go ahead and start. Um, hmm. So the question is, I do play, right? I'm pretty sure I, I actually play. That was the last of the hostages, boss. I don't even know who these dudes are. What is going on with your face, bro? Oh, but he sees me. He sees Midoriya pulling up. Oh, man. I think it's time for him to dip, right? Yeah. Right on cue. All right. Let's see what we can actually do here. So, um, shoot style. Okay. So, this is fairly early. And everything seems to be, like, auto combos. Okay. That actually looked pretty clean. I won't even lie about that. So... For the most part, there actually does seem to be a decent comboing system. You can start off with your special skill like this with the Q and then combo that into the basic attacks, which is actually pretty nice. I won't even lie. There's a dash button. I guess you can use that for dodging, of course. And then I'll just finish it off with the basic combo. That's pretty nice. The um, combat system isn't obviously like anything insane, but um, it's nice. I'll definitely say that. All right, here we are, more enemies to fight. Whoa, okay, I think they're trying to show me the dodge system right here. So what I'll do is I'll take this guy out with just some regular attacks, and then um, I'll save my special for the girl over here. Here we are, so once she gets back up, oh, wait, where'd she go? Oh, there she is, okay, so I'll start it off with that. I thought it led into the air. The first time I did it, I'm pretty sure it finished off in the air, but I'll just leave it at that, I guess. Okay, whoa, this man's coming in full charge. Minotaurus, okay. Bullhead. This is going to be a real test. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to dodge. Yep, there it is. Oh, so there's a perfect dodge system. And there's a parry. Okay, that's pretty cool. And I'll Okay, hold on. So yeah, that one does leave it in leave the opponent in the air. So like when they're stunned like that, I think that's a good time to start attacking. So what I'll do is I'll put him in the air one more time. Just like that. Perfect. So this guy, obviously, he's too big to get launched up. There we go. That was actually pretty clean. I won't even lie about that. That was pretty clean. All right. Now we got to get back to Death Arms. We got to tell him what just happened there. We get to tell him how we just clapped that entire clan. <laughs> okay. It looks like we got another ability unlocked here. Long press for charge. I also noticed that. Oh, okay. So we got smash now. That's pretty, that's pretty sick, actually. So, these guys are fairly low level. Sickle Claw. <laughs> I'll just take you out pretty quickly. I'll save my special for someone later in the round. Oh, I didn't even see that person. Whoa, what the? Okay, so I'll use that there. Get you in the air. Finish it with the combo. Perfect. Okay, that was pretty nice. Can't even lie about that. Perfect. I'm actually getting fairly used to the combos already. This isn't too hard. Whoa, what is this? What is this? I've never seen this guy before. Thousand Eyes, Quirk Curse. Okay, this is interesting. Let's see. Okay, yep, perfect. I figured he was going to do something like that. So I'll get in close. I'll try to get in close. I'll go into the combo immediately. Oh, okay. Okay, he clearly is not okay. Whoa, what the? Okay, what are, what's going on here? What's going on here? I'm just hitting the screen at this point. I'm confused. What just happened? Oh, dang. I think we took him off off screen. I was like, <laughs> I was like, what just happened right there? Oh, this guy's a little mad. He's a little mad that we stopped that so easily. Come on, man. You need, you need some better henchmen, bro. That was light work. That was light work, man. Okay, so yeah, this is what I really want to look into. Looks like there is a skill tree for... Um, for all the characters It looks like what, what am I using cash to upgrade them and there also does seem to be a um, Another type of currency like hero coins from the looks of it. I'll just go ahead and upgrade Midori right now since obviously I have to but uh I Do want to see like how I can start summoning that's probably the last thing I want to do before I end off the video Okay, so there seems to be a guard break. I'm gonna spam that there we go Keep the spam up perfect as you can see on the right side, the skill tree is starting to become pretty advanced. That's that uh, pretty quickly you can already get to see how the uh, combat system is actually. Uh, what I will say is I actually fairly enjoy the combat system so far. You know, it's more depth than something like Legends, where your combat system really is just like four buttons, or like Dokkan, where your <laughs> combat system is. Um... Now let me not even bring Dokkan into it. Something like Grand Cross, where your 
Oh! I did not even mean to do that. <laughs> Yo! Okay. I, that was overkill. I'm sorry. I admit that was overkill. I was not even trying to do that. Okay, here we go. What was this guy's name? I don't even think they said what his name is yet. We're about to find out though. Hanzo Sudan? Water control. Interesting. That shouldn't be an issue for Midori, right? Midori doesn't have any water-based attacks, so... I'm gonna wait for him, because he's probably gonna have... Oh, you're getting a little too close there, buddy. Please back up. Please back up. What are you doing? So, okay. Okay, okay. Get out of there. Now I understand why it's water control. Was that a shark? Did he just move me? What are you doing? Okay, I need to get in close. I need to go for a guard break. Perfect. I need to get that down. Charge that up. Okay, he is going crazy. I was getting ready to clown on the fact that he has water control, but that's actually pretty sick. I won't even lie. I'm going to charge him forward. Go for that. Get him up. No, okay. He is cutting me off at all angles. Let me get out of there. Let me get out of there quick. Whew. Okay, perfect. I can perfect dodge right there. I didn't parry in time, but what I will do is I'll get out of the way for that. My one for all is charged up. Obviously, I want to uh, charge up my one for all meter a little bit more at the bottom there. Okay, perfect timing. Go for the smash. There we go. Oh, that just that just knocked him out. Okay. He has two more bars of health. I can take him out. I can take him out quick. Let me go for my special. Get him up in the air. Go for the combo. It was perfect. Okay, this right here is going to wrap it up. Um, I've been recording for 30 minutes at this point. I have, This is the longest I've ever recorded for a video, but... Perfect way to end it, just with a single summon here. Okay, the summoning system looks pretty nice. My signature? What the? Do I actually have to draw my signature? As... <laughs> oh, what the? Okay. Oh, well, it's a si I'm dumb. It's a signature, of course. So it's supposed to be in cursive. All right. Well, the Kaminari, pretty solid. I don't, I don't know, like, how any good of the characters are in this game yet. Um... So hopefully I'll learn a little bit more about that. Kaminari is pretty solid though. Obviously, obviously I probably would have went for uh, Bakugo or Todoroki there. But that is going to wrap it up for the video here. Overall, uh, Ultra Impact or the Strongest Hero, whatever it's called in your region. It's a fairly solid game so far. I'm getting a lot of Grand Cross vibes from it, from the RPG aspect. Um, gonna have to look into the summoning system, see how that works. Um, overall, I really love the combat system. It's a lot more... Uh, interactive I think is the best way to put it. It's a lot more interactive than something like Legends where you're really just pressing four buttons or like Grand Cross where it's completely turn-based. Not sure if there's even PvP in this game. I'm not sure how PvP is going to work but if you guys do want to see more of the Strongest Hero content in the future make sure you leave a fat thumbs up on this video. Leave a like and a comment down below uh, if you guys want to see more. Like I said I did have a lot of fun with this video honestly and if you want to see more in the future I am perfectly fine with that. But that is going to wrap it up for today. If you did enjoy, make sure you like and subscribe. And remember to stay in school. I'll see you guys next time.